Good morning everyone. It is New Year's Day 2022. I'm on the M7 heading north out of Sydney. I've got a three and a half hour drive uh, today. Uh, I've been on the road for a bit over half an hour and I'm heading up to my old lakes. I'm going to go up to Narani. My Kareel Association each year does a New Year's Eve cruise so they've all been up there for a day or two. Um, I did New Year's Eve with the family last night and I'm heading up there for a day or two uh, and then I've got to go back to work uh, a little bit later this week. So that's what the plan is. Oh, I've just done a, a, made a video which I'll post probably with this one about my new solar panel that I've got for the boat to run my little fridge. Anyway, that tested that for a week, seemed to work. So that's in the back of the car, keeping my food cool, my little 15 litre uh, brass monkey. Yeah, uh, if that doesn't work, I haven't got a plan B, so I might be eating cheese and Mickey's for the next uh, day or two. Anyway, uh, should all be good, and I'll tune in with you a little bit uh, closer to the destination. Well, <clears throat> I finally made it. Here we are, by all lakes. New South Wales, about three and a half hours north of Sydney, about 60 k south of uh, Foster. And here we are, down at the Anchorage. We're in um, Nar uh, Narani Sands. Here's my disastrous interior. Um, I certainly don't travel neat or, or light. Anyway, it's the first time I've stayed on board the boat for the night, so this is going to be a bit of fun. I've put this on this side. Obviously, I'm sleeping there. I've got some of my loose uh, rigging stuff put over there for the time being, just temporarily. I've got a sail, uh, my bag and my garbage. Anyway, not a pretty sight. You should have seen it before, but it's a start and I need to um, have a bit, bit more go at organising it. I've got my head a bit burnt today getting here and getting the boat rigged up, even though I did wear my hat all day. Uh, so I'm going to wait till the sun goes down later on this afternoon and I'll uh, get out and about a little bit more. But in the meantime, it's lunchtime, so I'm just about to make myself a bit of lunch. All right, I'll check in soon. We drift over this way. And we stop soon. And then we drift back. It's almost mesmerizing. Well, that was dinner. 
doing the washing up now. Got my washing up tub. Got my awning up, fortunately, because it's just rained a little bit. Not, nothing major, but just a little bit. And I'm just going to turn that one off. Alrighty. stuff been washed and dried out everything else is in the dishwasher so I'll pack it up uh, after it's dried nice thing with Australia especially in summer things dry very quickly clean out half done just gonna put all this stuff back in and do the other side so here we go the boats all back together how I normally like to have it this is where I'd like to uh, have as my starting and end point. If I'm going out for a day sail, it doesn't get any more uh, 
uh, fuller looking than this. If I'm going out overnight for a couple of days, it stays the same. So that's the, the benchmark that I'm setting for myself and we shall see how we go on my next overnight, which at this stage is probably gonna be uh, 1G in about six weeks time for the nationals.